Thank you for joining us. I'm glad that you have tuned in again to keep us up to date in regard to the current crisis we are all experiencing. Like always, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them, those in the comment section below the video stream. We will respond to those or feel free to call Martin City Hall at 731-587-3126. Now, I know that many of you remain to be worried and anxious, and I want to assure you that we're still, still doing what we can here at the city with limited access. And restrictions continue to remain on all of our city buildings and city parks, greenways throughout the April uh, 30th. As of today, Wiki County has six confirmed cases. At the re recommendation from the University of Tennessee Municipal Technical Advisory Service, I issued a declaration of emergency this morning. The president and the governor both have issued emergency declarations. To qualify for FEMA and TEMA funding, I will be issuing an emergency declaration every seven days. This is just to ensure that when funding is available, we are prepared and ready to make an application. The official declaration of emergency is posted on the web, our website at www.cityofmartin.net. Last week, I mentioned that construction is designated as essential work under the order by the governor. We continue to monitor all construction work, making sure that there are plentiful sanitizing stations available and that workers are making their best efforts in following the guidelines. The library project is well underway. Some of the steel came in this week. It's already really starting to take shape. You can now see what an impression this building will make at the entrance of Lindell Street. This is an exciting time. The library will define us as a community and will offer many opportunities for every single resident. We're going to be an ex the example to all across the state, maybe even the nation, of what a 21st century library is supposed to be. Libraries are the cornerstone of a healthy community. We've had several inquiries regarding summer sports at the Martin Recreational Complex. We will not be announcing the decision on summer rec sports until late May. We made the decision this week to cancel the Music in the Park series this season. The Martin Community Band has been unable to assemble to practice. There's also a strong indication from state leadership that there will likely be social distancing measures in place still in May. I want to say something to our local retailers, restaurants, and salon service industries and your employees. I know that you're feeling the economic brunt of this crisis. Please be sure to talk to your banker or accountant if you have not already, and that you might be eligible for some of these federal programs. Our local banks and CPA firms have done an outstanding job of helping others during this time. It is times like this that are so important to help your fellow man. If there's anything we, you think that we might can help you with here at the city, please let me know. I remain hopeful that we are on the cusp of flattening the curve here in Tennessee. In an effort as we begin to plan about how we reopen and assemble, additional testing has been made available. If you're not feeling well, or think for any reason that you need to be tested, the governor has said that free testing will be made available at local health departments across the state. Data is needed to determine if we're at a place in this crisis that we are ready to start gradually reopening the economy. Again, if you think you need to be tested for COVID-19, it's available free at the Wick County Health Department and anyone can be tested. Remember, social distancing means to avoid group gatherings, sleepovers, play dates, crowded retail stores, visitors in your house, and to avoid traveling. And it means when you are at a grocery store or to pick up medicine, keep your distance from others at least six feet. And the CDC is recommending that you might even wear a mask. I cannot stress how important it is that you respect the guidelines and recommendations of the CDC and the state, and that you stay home nor host any gatherings in your home. 
Data from the state of Tennessee sh continues to show a trend that we may be on the downswing of all this. Please do not take any risk to jeopardize that trend. To keep uh, with updates from the city of Martin on Facebook and Instagram, go to our website, cityofmartin.net, and sign up for our elect electronic newsletter. We even have a new feature online where people can sign up for email or wireless alerts through text messaging. This will allow us to get important alerts to you related to weather, important news, and reminders. Enjoy your weekend. Be kind. Show gratitude. Try to do something to help those local businesses most affected during this time or someone who may be without work. <clears throat> be hopeful and know that this will pass soon if you stay home for now. I look forward to being with you again next week.